you're watching 1700. I'm Mariah. I'm Ryan. And we have Fort Royal here. Thanks so much for coming in, guys. Hello. No worries. G'day. Yeah, the performance. It's your second time here? Yes. Yeah. yeah. We second came in once. Second time in the studio. Awesome. We um, and we're celebrating your new single, um, Ain't Got You, which is yep. the first track you played for us there. Super fun, super catchy. We had a good dance over it here. It was fantastic. I was having a great boogie. It was super fun. <laughs> That's great. Um, do you want to tell us a little bit about the writing process or inspiration behind this one? Uh, not on camera, but there's a person in this room that the song's actually <laughs> written about. Oh, especially uh, someone. Yeah, yeah. It's it's just it's really a love song to be honest. Yeah. Mainly, it's it's just about it's just about realizing that people are important and that mm. people matter um, more so than anything else. And yeah you'd be stuffed without those people in your life. So that's really what it's about. Yeah. Yeah. Super catchy. Thank you. Yeah. It really is. So in the recording process for songs like this, how do you record? What's your what's your process? Do you record in the one place together? And Yeah, so all, all of Ain't Got You was recorded at Wagworth Studios mm -hmm. up in Caboolture, uh, which is just north of Brisbane where mm -hmm. we're from. So um, all the tracking was done in there uh, with an engineer called Trevor who um, we've, we've, worked, uh, we've worked with a few times now. Um, but yeah, it, it's a pretty cruisy process most of the time. It has its ups and downs, but um, but yeah, it's all done in in house up there at um, Wagworth. So yeah, cool. Awesome. Mm. And you guys have done seven independent tours so far down the east coast. Mm. Been a few. Yes, there's well, been, a few. <laughs> been a few. <laughs> Fair yes. few. <laughs> yes, the pain is set in definitely. Yeah. <laughs> as well as Blues Fest, Saint yeah. Kilda Fest, mm. yep. and Brisbane Zoo. Yeah, so we sold we sold out the zoo in Brisbane earlier in the year. That was our wow. homecoming show. Yeah, it was a great show. That's like our version of Zoo Twilights. Yeah. So yeah. fun. Yeah, it was awesome. It was really great. <laughs> um, and how do you prepare for a tour? since you've done it so many times? How do you prepare setting off for? Well, you get a care package. I've, I, I make sure I've got my vitamins, my minerals, <laughs> and uh, my flare collection, and that's about it. <laughs> a pretty big cardboard box. And a cardboard box, box full, full of food, food for my dad. And, 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 and wine. He's got chips, sultanas, Booze. apples, oranges. Booze. You've got it down pat. <laughs> Cookies sometimes. What else have you got? Everything. Absolutely everything. Do All you have a, a favourite place to play? Or Melbourne. venue? Melbourne. Melbourne? Melbourne. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah. Is it, do you Not actually weird. notice that the vibe is yeah. different? Yeah. It's funny because we we spent the last week in Sydney mm. and you sort of like you arrive into Melbourne <laughs> and you spend a day here and like oh. Sam and I are staying together oh. in the moment and it's just like oh my god this is just <laughs> and like it's cold but it's not too cold yeah um, at the moment yeah yeah it's obviously a rainy day today but um, I just stepped out of the door and said I'm moving here <laughs> <laughs> it's got a great vibe Going this on. city and I'm a big I'm a big AFL supporter as well oh, so being from Brisbane go. this is oh. like who do you play. Uh, I support Brisbane, <laughs> being from Brisbane, um, so it's a good time to be a Brisbane supporter. But, but yeah, it's great to come here and, and sort of feel welcome. It's nice. Yeah, so, awesome. Yeah. We'd love to have you. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's very tempted at the moment, but. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So uh, this is your second tour this year, correct? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. it is. Busy. Uh, how many shows have you got lined up so far? Um, well, we've got, geez, what is it? Three more to go on this. Yeah leg of the tour um pretty much all of it. i think we're almost yeah we're pretty much done so we've just got this weekend mm. yeah and then brizzy yeah. um Easy. so yeah but i think there was about 20 dates 25 dates on the tour or something. we do a bit of north queensland as well um, which is a sort of the regional oh yeah. areas up there which is very different we've had a festival up in rockhampton earlier in the year cool and that was really that was a lot of fun yeah and it's a beautiful part of the world up there it gets forgotten about sometimes yeah but yeah, it's cool. very cool like how do you Bundaberg. Yeah. Yeah. Bundaberg is yeah. a very yeah. fun yeah. place to play. Yeah. It's very cool. How do you find it doing so much traveling? Do you ever get like a bit drained and burned out? Yes. Or <laughs> like, yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Do, we, do we fight like siblings? Yes. Or? Yeah. yeah. And even worse sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> the last two weeks. If I can yeah. I, it's funny because like this is actually um, the first time that the whole band has been away for this yeah. long. Yeah. Um, as to, to get, it is. Yeah. I've never been away for more than like two weekends. So I, mm. it's when the whole band has been. I love when we hang out. Yeah, it's great. But, um, but yeah, it's, it's the longest that Port Royal's been away <laughs> together. <laughs> yeah. Um, which is yeah, it's having its moments. As you can tell we're very close. So yeah. yeah, I can see that. Yeah. Who's, who's the responsible one? Definitely me. Probably oh, the, the mother oh, hen. Oh, oh, probably, oh, probably, probably, yeah, probably. Oh, He's a mother hen, actually. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you rally the yeah. troops. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> mo most of the time, <laughs> it, it it can be hard to to keep. These three in line, oh. um, but you know, I try my, my very best. Sometimes yeah. you just got to give up and just move on and whatever. So. Oh, that's awesome. Well, um, <laughs> throw off question. 
Mm -hmm. If you could listen to one album for the rest of your life, <laughs> and one album only, what would it be? Probably no pressure. Yeah. It's a tough question. I've got to it's do very so broad. many. What's the story of Morning Glory by Oasis? Oh. Which is just awesome. From Any particular start. reasoning behind that show? It's just the like, greatest <laughs> album of all time. Yeah. Just <laughs> arrogance and Jeez. rock and roll power at 180,000 percent. It. And yeah. It's just <laughs> massive. And it's just beautiful songwriting from start to finish. And Amazing. it just takes you through every emotion under the sun and awesome. puts you through the washing machine. I sort of want to say something that's like um, generic, but... Um, yeah. Yeah, yeah, everything you've come to expect by the last Shadow oh. Puppet. <laughs> that's, that's a good album. It's just sex. I'd probably say I Am by Arctic Monkeys. Oh, oh that's a great one too. So good. You inspired me there, Sam. Yeah. Thanks, <laughs> Thanks for that. Yeah. What a man. I'd, uh, I'd listen to Is This It by The Strokes. Oh, that's good oh. too. Good album. Love that. Yeah. Oh, awesome. The Strokes. Very eclectic yeah. choices here. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> cool. Well, thank you guys so much for coming in and giving us a performance. And uh, congrats again on the new single and the tour. Um, hope you make it to the end. <laughs> <laughs> we do too. <laughs> Don't worry, we do too. Yeah. Where can, our, um, where can our watchers find you on socials? You can find our Spotify page, Port Royal, official artist on Spotify. An official Port Royal Insta? Yes. There is yeah. a Port Royal, Port Royal official, official on Insta and Facebook. Port Facebook. <laughs> and portroyalband.com is where you can find our merchandise and That's things it. like Excellent. that. Excellent. Well, if you've been watching and you're keen to keep track of Port Royal and what they get up to, get onto their Spotify page and follow them on Instagram and Facebook. And you're watching 1700.